What's up, Pandu? Peter Von Panda here. Bought myself a case from Ann's Top, and I have two pieces of really good news at the end of this video, so uh, definitely let's take a look at this together. It comes in this box. Uh, it is for the iPhone 7 Plus, and looks like it's taped up at the top and the bottom. So, open that up here. We're going to have to pry it open a little bit and take a look at the case. So, you have screen protector accessories and kind of a nice little, like, uh, travel pouch. I feel like I'm flying first class and giving your little accessories kit. And then in this little sleeve here, it looks like we have a, like, a pretty substantial... I don't know if this is tempered glass, but it's either thick plastic or it is like glass. And it's square or rectangular, and so it fits only on, you know, the glass, kind of the visible portion of the glass. So it fits just like that. It looks like, you know, like many screen protectors, you pull this off and then it's going to be adhesive. So we're not going to fool around with that any more than that at the moment. I just want to open up. The case, the and stop case here, and take it out. Look at that! There's a phone in there. Nope, just a piece of paper. Uh, what's interesting about this is that it's really two pieces, and it kind of goes all the way around your phone, and that's why there's glass included, apparently, because you have. Oh, look at this! There's another piece. So <laughs> another piece of glass, and so what ends up happening is that your front of the phone gets covered, and that glass piece will fit right inside. So. Uh, effectively you'll have a nice uniform surface all the way around because you won't have kind of the glass recessed um, and it should allow you to click through so let's just take a look at the case here itself it's two pieces kind of a hardened plastic uh, you know very thin you know thin kind of plastic here but it's a little bit of that soft touch you know matte finish it's all black pretty big cutout here for the dual camera of the iPhone 7 plus can uh, microphone and, and flash there and then it's enclosed all the way around the top and on the bottom the cutouts for the speakers microphone and lightning port and then all of the side buttons are on this second piece so we have the power button right here and as you can see it's hinged only on one side there get it to focus there hinged on one side so that you can push it in and out uh, the front here has cutouts for the light sensor and the speaker and the camera and then there's a cutout here for your home button and then on this side, you have the volume rocker buttons, and they are kind of hinged on one side as well, so that the, those are flexible. And then you have a pretty big cutout here. So the whole thing gets wrapped up. Now, because I'm shooting this with my iPhone 7 so that we can get you full 4K resolution, I'm going to put it on my older iPhone 6 Plus here. So just understand that the camera isn't going to line up correctly because it's not, uh, you know, on the same sort that doesn't have the same camera hardware, but everything else should line up as if it were a seven plus. I'm going to hook it over the busy side of the, the, the numbers there and then slide it over on like that. And man, it's pretty easy to put together. Uh, it's cool because it's kind of an interlocking, you know, um, case design. And so you have kind of actually kind of a cool little, uh, contour body line all the way around and look at that I mean um, you know it's a little fingerprinty but you know if you had the uh, touch sensitive button right there you could just kind of you're just tapping it a little bit um, and so you don't actually have to depress it as much as you do like on the actual iPhone 6 button here but obviously the whole screen is visible and then you would take your included glass screen here remove the protective film and then drop it in and it would fill in the space just like that and look at this i mean you still have it's still perfectly touch sensitive through the through the glass i haven't i obviously haven't applied it because i'm gonna apply it to my iphone 7 and then the buttons look at that no problem work just fine and click everything just fine hit the volume mute switch and you know it's just nice you know it's not necessarily you know the the edges aren't you know, it's not so tight that everything's uh so compressed that there there isn't a little bit of gap which is nice uh but it provides protection unlike some other cases all the way around the phone literally on the front as well especially when you have this glass in i mean there's nothing 
you know, there's really almost no exposed part of the phone. So that's what makes this and stop case so interesting and I think kind of unique in that regard. So it's it's a pretty cool, pretty cool case that provides a kind of a level of protection that you don't get on anything else. Now, two cool things. Uh, first of all, I'm going to give this case away. So if you have a 7 Plus, uh, please enter this giveaway. All you got to do is like this video, subscribe to my channel, and then comment below with the country that you live in in the comment. Because um, once we pick a winner, which will be the first Saturday in April. What is it? Saturday? April 4th? 3rd? Something like that? Uh, first Saturday in April, I will pick a one random commenter. Read your comment if you have uh, the country listed as USA or Canada, and that's the only places that are eligible because that's where I can afford to ship it to. Um, you'll win it. I will reach out to you and send this off to you. The other thing is, I will put a link to this case in the description, and I, uh, I've also reached out to the, the cool people at Anstop, and they have provided a discount code, a pretty serious discount code nonetheless, too. So that's going to be active for a little while so if you want to buy it um you know follow the link to the to the case use the code in the description and get yourself a a pretty hefty discount on this case i think you're gonna like it if you want the slim fit yet kind of complete protection like some of the more rugged cases give you i think this is your best bet it doesn't really affect the form factor but really does provide very comprehensive protection so and stop iphone 7 plus case peter von panda out